Mm -hmm. I'm Dean of the UCL Faculty of Education, Institute of Education, where I'm also a professor of applied linguistics. My work concerns various different aspects of bilingualism and language contact. Uh, so I've worked on a number of things like language maintenance, language shift in ethnic minority communities, especially immigrant communities with different languages. I've worked on family language policy, uh, language acquisition and uh, speech language disorders of young bilingual children, uh, as well as um, language policy and language in education policy concerning uh, bilingual and multilingual uh, children and communities. So it's really different aspects of bilingualism and multilingualism that I'm interested in. And my focus has always been on the actual everyday practices of people using multiple languages and other semiotic resources for communication. And I take a very broad ethnographic approach to uh, trying to understand how the language uh, users make sense of their own worlds through such dynamic multiple uh, multilingual practices. So the so-called research questions I ask come out of my observations of the actual pra uh, multilingual practices, not derived entirely from theory. So practice comes first. I want to then theorize what I have observed through analysis. But crucially, I also want the theory that is developed on the basis of practice to be applicable to further observations and further analysis of other practices. So it's this practice theory, practice cycle that I'm interested in. And the original reason uh, for me to get into the whole field of bilingualism, multilingualism and language contact is indeed a very personal one because uh, I am of uh, um, Manchu background, my family's uh, Manchu background, uh, which is an ethnic minority that has lost its uh, language in China. Uh, so I'm always interested in how uh, groups of people lose their language um, and the impact on their identity and subjectivity and all, all their kind of world view. And when I came to uh, Britain in the 80s, I noticed that the ethnic minorities, especially those of uh, non-European immigrant background, uh, are losing their uh, ethnic language rapidly. And that's how I got into uh, bilingualism and, language, uh, and, and um, contact linguistics uh, initially. And over the uh, years, I'm really interested in the um, well-being of uh, a bilingual ethnic minority learners, especially. And I also want to um, monitor or basically follow the kind of social cultural changes that are happening in Britain and how that impacts on the lives of as a minority uh, communities and multilingual speakers, but also their contributions to uh, the changing uh, society in Britain. So I kind of follow the new uh, uh, ways of, uh, of uh, communicative practices uh, of uh, bilingual, multilingual uh, speakers uh, and uh, the connections between society on one hand and language practice on the other.